what up? It's your boy J.O. Another episode of Worldly J.O. Got a good show for y'all today. Hit your like, subscribe, turn on your notification, put it on all. I'm gonna be right back. back y'all like I always say man I appreciate y'all coming through rocking with your mans man uh, you could be anywhere in the world just rocking with your boy man I appreciate that uh, today I just got a message from my, my fellow brothers and sisters our community, meaning the urban community, the black community, whatever you want to name it, uh, there's a reason why they make us the most popular, why our culture is the most popular. And why we have so much influence. It's a reason for that. You wanna know what that reason is? It's cause we are so easily controlled. I'll say it again. It's because that we are so easily controlled. Dangle a couple of dollars in our face. Give us a couple of dollars so we can do this with the money and yeah, I got all this. Bear hug the dollars and all that. Just give them a couple of dollars. They do whatever you tell them. Uh, then you have, well, show them a little attention and they'll fall in line. They want to keep that attention so that you can control them there. Uh, Give them a nice car, a nice pair of shoes. Cause they ain't used to having it. They'll basically do whatever they want, whatever you want to do. So, with that being said, that is the reason why they allow. Because if they didn't want it, it wouldn't happen. Our dollars add up so we get their dollar let them put this on give them a couple dollars to put this on give them a couple dollars to put this shirt on give them a couple let them be popular put that on and the rest of them gonna buy up everything you got they ain't gonna have no more in the stores because they everybody want to do that so we have to learn to be individuals that protect each other and advise each other. We gotta learn how to accept constructive crit criticism. We have to be able to band together to protect our neighborhoods and our, our, you know, our food supplies or whatever we got. Whatever we need to protect, we need to stick together, treat each other equal, and then band together to protect what we have If that ain't your main goal, then I really ain't, I ain't, I ain't rocking with it. 
If you want some tear brother down, if you want some talk crazy about this brother right here, get the clout. Tell him he a rat. Tell him he this. That. If you a rat, it's evident. We know a rat when we see one, man. You know somebody who is spineless. You know what I'm saying? You can tell when somebody's spineless. If they spineless, they're going to tell to save themselves. You should see them coming a mile away. You know what I'm saying? I just don't understand this, this community we in, man. It's this YouTube community. How every, we can control them. Bump him up in the algorithm. They're going to attack him. While they distracted with all that goofiness right there, whatever's going on in the world, they ain't worrying about it. That's entertainment to them. Not peace and prosperity and equal rights. and They don't care nothing about that. They worrying about uh, Kwame Brown versus Hassan Campbell. They worried about uh, whatever gummy, whatever y'all want to call them against Carcino. They want to know about uh, whatever YouTuber versus another YouTuber. You get on here talking like I'm talking, they don't want to hear it. I don't care. Somebody want to hear it. Like I tell you, my money don't come from YouTube. <clears throat> My money don't come from YouTube, so I'm not worrying about the money. I would like to one day be, you know, just get up and make some uh, videos, about two, three of them a day or something, or whatever. Go eat and have fun and then all that, nah, nah, nah. You know what I mean? I don't live with my girl. I don't, I pay bills, I pay, you know, we have a, t a, a system over here where the bills is paid on time and we doing all right. You know what I'm saying? I got my house, studio, got cars, uh, whatever. I ain't got a lot. I just got what I need. See what I'm saying? And as long as I got what I need, I'm rich. I don't care what you say, what my dollar amount say. If I got what I need and I'm happy and then my spiritual space is solid, I'm richer than Michael Jackson. Because all that money don't make you happy. I'm happy, B. Straight up. My girl, my kids, you know, may have situations here and there, but that's life. Everything is fine with me, man. I'm happy. I'm just trying to do something, make myself a little bit better every day. Just a little bit. Every day I want to make myself just a little bit better, man. You know what I'm saying? So we got to stop following and being trendy and, and, and letting them influence what we appreciate and, you know, letting all this take, take you know, a toll on them, this community, man. Stop clout chasing. You don't need to. Just talk about you. My YouTube page, this thing right here, this, my platform, is mine. I say what I want. I be mindful of the authorities all the time. I learned that from the street. Be mindful of the authorities and they'll leave you alone. Uh, I say what I want. I do what I want. When I want. Because it's mine. I don't even think about the money. I don't know how much money in that account. Maybe one day to have something in it. <laughs> It might be something. You know what I'm saying? I got my subscribers up a little bit. That's why I took it down. I don't let, I don't show how many subscribers I got because I don't want that to be what draws you. Everybody else like him. I'm going to go see what he's talking about. Nah, I want you to run across this video. Peep the realness in the videos. And make a decision. Therefore, I know you a solid dude. You down, really down for the, what I'm talking about. Not clout chasing. One day I'll open it back up and let y'all see. But it's growing. 
I'm seeing what I need to see right now to keep me motivated to do this. So, uh, and another thing I want to touch on, this is just a pet peeve I have. This is something I can't stand. Uh, stop flashing your money, man. This right here, all that with the phone and all that. Come on. Come on, man. You Come on. That's the dumbest thing. The dumb You want them to say, oh, yeah. All right. That's what's up. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's disrespectful. Yeah. You ain't got this. Yeah. That's disrespectful, man. You flashing your money in front of me for? I got bread, son. Mine's is just tied up in these assets. Yeah. When that's gone, you done. Man, let's think about it, man. Stop flashing your money, man. I hate that. I hate it. And I'm not no robber. I'm not no dude. I'm never going to take nothing from no man because that means that I'm admitting that that man is better than me. If I got to take something from another man, that means that man is better than me. He can get what I need and I can't. So that keeps me in my space. You know what I'm saying? Keeps me, you know what I mean? I got principles. You know what I'm saying? Morals. I live by codes, not the street code because I ain't in the street, homie. But I don't, you know, been there, done that, all that. We ain't got to get into all that. But I ain't in the street no more. So I don't live by that street rule. I mind my business. I tend to my business. And I'm going to protect mine. And that's the rule I live by. You know what I'm saying? Mind your business, protect your own. Get your own. and get your ass out the street.